Now, mushrooms make for a delicious pizza topping, but what if they could also help in cleaning up the environment? A non-profit in California is studying using mushrooms to protect waterways. Our next report has more. Western states in America have been dealing with an increase in wildfires, leaving homes gutted and causing widespread devastation. Environmentalists have been concerned about the toxic chemicals released from burned homes into the soil. Our homes are built of toxic materials, unfortunately, from the insulation to the walls to double-paned windows full of weird gases. I mean, you can just imagine every nook and cranny of a home this day, to the day is full of toxic materials. So those fires will burn it down into the really harsh chemicals that will eventually make their way to our waterways. Just last Meet Thonji Wool Sweatser. Last year, her home in the Santa Cruz mountains burned down in a wildfire. She is now trying to do her bit to help restore the ecosystem by donating her land for an experiment. Here, mushrooms are being used to help break down chemicals found in the ashes of items destroyed by fires. Yes, you heard that right. Mushrooms. We know about mushrooms. We like to put them on our eggs for breakfast, you know, all that kind of stuff. But I didn't know that they had this amazing ability. Um, and I learned about research that's been done in the past of oil, where they've been used to, to clean up oil spills and, and other incidents. And, and so it just seemed like a perfect match for, for you know, coming in after post-fire. Now, how exactly is this being done? A California nonprofit called Corn Wall is using mushroom-filled tubes and logs. These are being placed around the perimeters where homes once stood to help filter and biodegrade toxic debris in the burn zones. There's many different species of fungi that are known to break down various harsh toxic chemicals and they've figured out that the Pleurota species in particular is really great at breaking down petrohydrocarbons, petroleum-based products. And so that's why we're utilizing our native oyster mushroom to break down any toxins that are coming from these home sites. The research will help protect waterways from toxic pollutants in the future. Similar tests are being carried out in many other burn zones across Northern California. Our hope is that, you know, uh, with this coming fire season and the one after that and the one after that, uh, we can continue this research and uh, develop some methodologies that are affordable, that are ecological and uh, are doable, are easy. Um, it, so that, you know, other communities that are coming together after the fire to, to protect their um, waterways uh, can be using these same methods. Be a report. We on. World is one. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.